Hello, my sumo peeps. Um, I recently have been playing with fonts and uh, decorating them like such, and um, I've had a couple of people ask me how you install fonts and in sumo paint or in Photoshop or whatever, and really you're just installing fonts into your computer, and then whatever photo editor you use to decorate your fonts uh, will have them available in their text options. So I will walk you quickly through how to do that. Or, you know me, not quickly. <laughs> anyway, uh, what I find is the best place for fonts is dafont.com, D-A-F-O-N-T.com. And you'll see they really have thousands of fonts here, but we'll pick one and uh, play with it. I tend to like um, all kind of cool, cool fonts. <laughs> Cool fonts like that. You'll see I did one called Speed with that. Um, I like these ones that look like they're falling apart. So I'll choose this Soul Mission. Just push download. I download to my desktop. And this is the same whether you have Windows or Mac. Um, these fonts come with an installer. So when you have it on your desktop, you've got a zip file. Just double click it to unzip it. And you'll notice a folder opens up. If you open up that folder, you'll see Soul Mission TTF and TTF is a file that will install fonts and they usually give us a little picture of what you can do with those. So we will open that up and install those fonts called Soul Mission and choose install font. And Soul font is installed. So now we open up Sumo Paint and this is, you can open up a GIMP or or Photoshop or any other photo editor that uses text and be able to do this. We'll start a new image. And I like to start with the gradient on the back, so we'll choose my favorite gradient, which is that one. And choose reverse, just because I like that. And we'll choose this one. And we'll do that. Okay, so next layer, we'll go to text. And we'll go down and you see these are, I have a ton of fonts installed on my system here, but we're looking for that soul whatever. So we'll go find that. Just because that's the one we just installed. I really love, um, love fonts. They're fun to play with. So I can't remember the name of it. Snot. <laughs> There's snot. Actually, close because I already had um, had Sumo open. So let's close that and reopen it because we should have uh, we should have reopened it afterwards just so that it would install the font. So here we are. Start all over again. right there okay so let's make a make it big put your text box in the middle there and let's write down soul Go move that if we transform make it nice and big and there you have it there's your text so I don't know let's do a quick decorating of it. Let's add another layer. Let's select pixels. Let's choose this next layer up. And we'll put another gradient over it. This 
is where it gets boring, but oh well. We'll uh, duplicate this layer. We'll flip that upside down. Move it down. Turn it into a shadow, basically. Which I've done in other tutorials, so we know how to do that. Let's uh, saturation. as well or any Photoshop or any photo editor that uses fonts. So that's how you install fonts on your computer and use them. Make cool stuff out of them. So I will talk to you later. Bye.